Hello Ospreys and Armbray families and welcome to the summer update for Friday June 26th. As usual we have a lot of good stories to share beginning with announcing the winner of the Armbray House Cup. That's the year-long competition between our three houses Salton, Daphne and Lang. So today we announce the winner. But in order to enhance suspense you're going to have to read the update to find out who that is. Uh, secondly, uh, next week we will be releasing a survey for primary to grade 12 families on tech availability to students and families. This is in advance of reopening in September. We just want to find out what the landscape there is, so please look for that survey next Friday. Thirdly, thank you to all those uh, parents that volunteered for our Diversity and Inclusion Advisory Council. Mrs. Morrison has kindly agreed to chair that council and she will be reaching out to you with next steps. As you know, our summer programming begins Monday with week one of Bike Camp, Thursday a Summer Academy launches, and a week from Monday Osprey Day Camps begin. There is still space available in week two of Bike Camp, and there are still spaces available in the August Day Camp, so please check out the update to register for those. And finally, uh, this month we say farewell to three of our beloved Armbray staff members, Mr. John Stone, Mr. Rick Pemberton, and Mr. Paul Myers. Uh, but in reality, it's just the beginning of their farewell tour. Uh, this summer, you will have the privilege of viewing in-depth interviews with each of them. And in the fall, we will set aside a day for each of Mr. Stone, Mr. Rick, and Mr. Myers, so that students can uh, say goodbye, congratulate them, and present each of them with a unique gift. That's it for me. Have a great weekend. Bye for now.